Hey SnowRunner fans, in this video we're going to look at the Crew Cab Trail Brawler. Before we get started though, I'd like to send a huge shout out to all my subscribers and everyone that's liked and commented on and shared my videos in the last while. It's you guys that keep the channel moving forward. Thank you very much. So as I said, we're going to be looking at the Crew Cab Trail Brawler. And uh, before we take it out, we're going to of course customize it. We'll put the better engine on and a better gearbox yeah better suspension trail runner spec for tires we'll put 50 inch uh, which ones did I choose? yeah the IROX 50 inch IROX alright for the winch we'll have the spec 12 volt winch Diff lock will be on. Went in low gear, of course, and we'll have a snorkel for those watery parts. For the front bumper, we're going to add a couple of things off road protection and a little help there. Interior, we're not going to put the gun rack. For the bumpers, we're going to put the chrome front bumper and the license plate on the back. For the hoods and grills, chrome grill and the brawler hood. For towing and hauling, we're not really uh, going to be doing any towing or hauling with this truck, although it's perfectly capable. <coughs> A couple of tow hitches there tire carrier there's every bead that you'd like every wheel for every tire so you can make it look as good as you want while carrying a spare the perfect spare fenders and trim will put mild fender flares I like fender flares but not too big for the rims we'll put the brawler bead locks And for the color choice, we're going to choose this sort of worn black, but there are many, many, many to choose from, including skull and crossbones and lots of really flashy colors. All kinds of blues that I love, nice greens as well, some good yellows and purples, tans, you name it, it's here. There's a shiny black and a flat black got it all. Just about any color you'd want, you'll be happy in it to, to find that it's here for you for this truck. But as I said, I'm going to be sticking with the... <laughs> not the skull and crossbones, no, no. With the worn looking black. Alright. There are no decorations, so we'll leave the garage, take a look around the outside of this truck, Again, it's a crew cab pickup. Called the Trail Brawler. As opposed to the Trail Bruiser, which I uh, demoed and reviewed yesterday, I believe it was. Trail Bruiser, very similar, similar look, similar uh, seat belts in the back, racing seat belts. Nice look in this truck. Gauges don't work, but the mirrors do. Good view out the driver's side. Now that we've taken a look inside and out, we'll start it up and we'll move it over towards the pit, the mud pit, just outside of the. Uh, Blacksmith Falls, I believe it is. Of course, we'll take a little um, off road journey on the way towards the mud pit just to see what it'll do off road. Handles itself very well. Oh yeah, not 
without getting itself into too much trouble here. Even though this is pretty rough. Good indication of uh, what this truck could do as a scout. I know it's kind of meant to race against its uh, similar looking cousin, if you will. But that said, if you're not going to be joining with a buddy and playing co-op or multiplayer uh, and you're just driving this thing on its own, you're not racing or anything, this would make a really capable scout. Look, it's going through the mud here. No worries. Very capable. All right. We're done with the mud pit. Uh -huh. Where have I heard that horn before? All right, now we're off to the quarry. See how well this thing does. In the slippery hills of the quarry. Slippery, rocky, steep. Lots of places to get tripped up down here. Or down there. Where we'll be in a moment. I passed it a little and I didn't want to put it in reverse. I'll just let it back up a little and then we'll pull it around here. Here we go. Yeah, that was easy. Next one, just as easy. Okay, now we'll put it in auto. Get a little of the power going. Take it over one of my favorite shortcuts. go straight up and out of here. Well done. That was a quick run through the quarry. Without issue. No points removed on any of the gear. No flipping the truck. And we're able to come up out of here unscathed. There we go. Flying as we do. And here comes that laser beam horn again. Cool. Alright, now we're done with the quarry. We'll move on to the fast moving current in the Yukon. Flooded foothills map. Again, this is just outside of the garage there. Is it Black River Fall? Ah. That was a quick run, I tell you. Usually pickup trucks get hung up across there, but this one and uh, the Trail Bruiser made really good time along here. Well, that was our look at the uh, Crew Cab Trail Brawler. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did like the video or found it helpful, I'd appreciate it if you hit the like button. That'd be great. And while you're there and you're not a subscriber, or if you're not a subscriber, why not uh, become a subscriber? That'd be just awesome as well. Um, let's see. In the meantime, Stay safe and take care, and until the next video, bye for now.